These are two of five training aircraft that the Philippine Navy received Monday from Japan. The aircraft will be used to boost patrols of our coastline and for humanitarian assistance. These are called the Beechcraft TC-90. They are the fruit of a bilateral cooperation project in defense equipment between Japan and the Philippines signed in February 2016. The Philippines is leasing the five Beechcraft TC-90 from Japan for a total of 28,000 U.S. dollars or about 1.4 million pesos each year. Once Japan amends a law that previously banned it from exporting weapons or military equipment, the five aircraft will be donated to the Philippines. Aviation experts say the Beechcraft TC-90 can fly some 1,900 kilometers, almost double the flight range of the aircraft being used by the Philippine Navy at the moment. The speed and range of the aircraft will improve the response time and reach of our maritime air surveillance. Itong Beechcraft, designed siya para pang ISR. So, ibig sabihin, Kung malagyan na siya ng mga equipment, magagamit natin siya. Hindi lang sa pagpatrolya sa maritime patrol, pati na rin sa ating internal security operation. Pwede natin magamit sa Sulu, sa Basilan, sa Tawi-Tawi. National Defense Secretary Delphine Lorenzana says that the lease of the training aircraft does not mean that there will be joint patrols between Japan and the Philippines. There is none. We do not have uh, the mechanism yet for uh, maybe joint patrol with the Japanese uh, naval forces here in uh, West Philippine Sea. But for freedom of navigation, I think uh, anybody can pass through. Uh, innocent passage is out allowed by international law. Uh, freedom of navigation is, uh, is uh, respected uh, for all countries passing by our territory. However, Japan's Ministry of Defense commits to supporting the Philippines in the areas of humanitarian assistance and maritime security. The last three of the five Beechcraft DC-9 here are expected to arrive mid-2018. Trisha Trada, CNN, Philippines.